what's up what's up what's up what's up amazing amazing good people here we are again coming live from decibel audio kenya remember we are situated uh, we are situated at the junction of lutuli avenue and uh kamai road when you come to lutuli avenue along lutuli avenue there's a road called kamai road we are situated right at the center of lutuli avenue in the road called kamai road come check us out decibel audio kenya uh we want to bring you yet another video sorry it's been uh, forever since we, we we brought you a video but we are back with so many videos are uh, lined up for you and always remember to subscribe like our content and uh, comment to these videos if you have any form of question regarding sound or public address system always feel free to write the question there which i'll address each and every question that you guys have so without further ado we want to get right into the video today we want to talk about this thing that is uh being portrayed right over here it's called a snake cable it's called a snake cable it's right over there as you can see it we have also discovered a new way to do these videos you can see me as you also see the see the item that we we shall be talking about so it's an amazing 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 thing so we also hope the sound is becoming better every single day we shall keep on improving on the video and audio as you people has been asking us to improve and to become better each and every uh, now and then so without further ado let's go straight into that thing that's called the snake cable so what's a snake cable a snake cable is a snake cable <laughs> right so a snake cable is a gadget that we use so that when you have the sound system at the stage and you have your mixer at the back then you have a gadget or you have the snake cable now that you use to transfer your signals from the front all the way to the back so one side has this particular plate right over here so this plate goes into the stage okay most people call it the stage box so this is the stage box that remains at the stage then we have these other ends then we have that cable over there so that cable stretches all the way from the back into the front all right so the stage box will remain at the front and then the cable and these pins will go into your mixer all right so these cables uh depends with the length that you want so depends with the length of your ground or your stage or wherever you are working from you also have a determination of the channels that you need the number of inputs the number of outputs that you need so this particular one is a 24 channel no it's a 16 channels actually it's a 12 channel so it's called a 12 channels input and a four channels returns so the input is these ones okay so these are the inputs all this i like this view so all these from number one you can see number one over here all the way to number 12 over here so this is where you put all your inputs your microphones your guitars your uh, whatever anything that's stamped as an input goes in there then we have these four a to d so a to d normally are called outputs this way you get your signal going back or going into your amplifiers all right so whatever signal you will have sent out from the mixer will come out from these spots so these spots will feed your amplifiers and then your amplifiers will feed your speakers that's our so you have the inputs and the outputs so that is basically what the what the stage box looks like some other stage box will look different i'll show you but this one is a simple one if you want to do permanent insulation this one is advisable because you don't need so much uh, the drums and stuff you only need the the stage box the cables and the plugs then we have the cable itself which is now this one this is called this is what uh is called the snake cable now this one is because it's uh it's elastic it's elastic it can stretch you can fold it it can move like a snake i think that's where the word came from snake cable because you can twist it you can bend it you can do it do whatever you want with it it's flexible you are able to use it in a flexible manner then you have these other pins these are the normal male and female pins okay so we have 12 males and then we have four females so the males are going to get into your mixer all right so wherever you have your mixer you're going to use them you're going to put them inside your mixer so you remember you have the mixer at the back of the stage so you plug in those pins into your mixer and they are labeled okay so challenge number one is written as number one so if you want to know the the pin the pin that uh going to number one let me show you we are looking for one 
So I have Maina and I have Alex as well. They are helping me today. And we are looking for number one. Let's see who will get it first. Yeah, they are, they are. Hey, Alex is very fast. This is Alex. Let, let me show you Alex. Very happy. Yeah, very happy to get number one. He was always number one in class. Maina was number last. So this is number one. It's indicated here as one. So if you have one then you know you are controlling one with this particular with this particular pin then for the outputs they are labeled as well we have uh from a to d all right so we have from a to d so perhaps you can see one for example this is d i'm sure you can see yes there so this is d so d is an output because it's a female so the female this is a all right so there are so many so they are from one to four not not so many they are from one to four this particular one but there are other snake cables that have one to eight one to twelve depending with the particular snake cable that you're using but basically that is it you just plug the stage box on the stage then you go with it the female part or the pins part you go with them in, into your mixer you plug them into your mixer so you are able to control if it's microphone number one you are pushing from your mixer slider then on the stage the microphone number one's volume will increase all right or decrease now depending with the uh, whatever operations that you are doing that is basically it they come in different sizes they come in different prices this particular one 12 channels four returns 30 meters goes for about 38 40 thousand if you come to a shop we can give you at 38 thousand but normally on market is around 45 thousand but because we are decibel audio we always give you competitive good quality and best 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 prices in market then we also have uh, have others that have 24 channels and uh, 50 meters we also have a hundred meters and 32 channels that's inputs and then eight returns that particular one, we also have it in this shop it's going for 145,000 any other shop in kenya they sell them from 185,000. but again because we are decibel we give you best price and because we care about our clients we give best price best quality and best information and knowledge that's why we work so hard to bring you these videos guys so that you can be able to educate you and also be able to share the information that we have because it's freely 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 given we give it back to you freely as a sign of appreciation because we are always thankful for you guys always coming through for us so that is it we were to show you the other types of snake cable if you're doing commercial services if it's a public address for hire if you are always on the move you can buy these other types of uh, snake cable uh you can you can come on this side uh, remove that box bonamina so there's one that's down here okay so this particular one as you can see yes the one that uh, mina is 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 pointing that one yes i think we can see it clearly yes that one so this one is still a snake cable it's only that it comes with a with a with a with a cover on it it has a wheel or the, uh, the snake cable has a wheel you are able to it's portable you're able to move around with it but the features are the same the stage box then you pull the cable all the way to the back then you have the pins to complete your work so that was it that is it a uh, snake cable snake cable it's been an amazing video we bring you more amazing, 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 amazing videos. Remember, we are your favorite shop. Decibel Audio Kenya. Decibel Audio Kenya. Decibel Audio Kenya. Never forget that name. Decibel Audio Kenya in Mombasa. We are located at um, uh, ba Safka Plaza, Bamburi Mtambo. We are located right there opposite Baraka Estate. When you go there, ask for Decibel Audio. Actually, the shop is, uh, is well uh, displayed. You'll see Decibel Audio. So without further ado, let me say bye-bye. The other guys can also say bye-bye. They can appear from whatever angle. So that is Maina. Maina is saying bye-bye. Then we have Alex. Alex is helping me. We also have Melissa coming from the office. Melissa, say bye-bye. Bye -bye. That's Melissa. Then we have Alex. Alex is there. Yeah, he's called Alex Moteti. So we are done with that video. We'll come, we come with more videos. Don't, we want... To give you more amazing videos all right yeah. so it's cheers guys and have a wonderful wonderful blessed time from wherever you were watching me from